guys, welcome back to my channel. My name is Peppany and I make videos on fashion and styling. So if you are into that kind of thing, then you should definitely, definitely stick around. Now today's video is an exciting one. I decided to shop my closet for the fall 2022 trends. Now, if you are regular to this channel, you know that I'm not specifically into trends, like making sure that I have them, but I think it's always fun for a little challenge to see if I have them when I, whenever I find these lists. Um, so I'm gonna be going based off of the Harper's Bazaar 2022 fall trends, just because that's always my favorite list. Um, so I have, I think it's like 11 outfits here that are each based on one of the new trends for this year for fall. And I'm excited to show you guys. Um, one other thing, I have reached 1,000 subscribers. I'm so excited, honestly. This is, I mean, as this time of recording this video, because I know sometimes it dips down, dips up, whatever, but at the time of recording this video, I've hit 1,000 subscribers and I am so very excited just because, I don't know, it's just cool. It's like finally four digits, woo, it's exciting. So I'm so happy that you guys are here. Please continue to let me know what you would like to see. Uh, don't forget that in a few weeks on October 17th, my book will be coming out. So I'll definitely probably post a short little blurb to announce that um, the day of so you don't forget and leave the link as well. So, and also if you want to know ahead of time, you can use the link below to just sign up to get an email whenever it does come out. I also wanted to reach out to any of my fellow Floridians. I hope you guys are all doing okay. I know the storm that came through was really devastating for a lot of people. I'm so, so blessed that it was totally fine for me and my family. We were out of power for maybe two hours um, and that was it, but I know a lot of people were not as fortunate. So I'm definitely keeping you guys in my prayers and I mean that for sure every single day. I'll be praying for you guys and lifting you up. Um, yeah, let's get back into the video. But anywho, let's get right into the shopping, my mostly thrifted closet for uh, 2022 fall trends. Alrighty, so for this first trend, which is called Robe Life for robe like jackets, I have this thrifted top, a pair of jeans from Zara that are super old, and I'm gonna be wearing what I call my city boots because I bought them right before I moved up north and started working in the city. Um, those are really old from Marshalls. The bag is thrifted, and this cardigan coat rope thing is also thrifted. I know the rope coats, they have more in mind like a wrap coat, but like with a tie in the middle, but I didn't have one of those that I thought would fit the trend. So I think this one works really well because it has a hoodie and it kind of looks like a robe anyway. And sometimes I even use it as a robe when it's really cold. So I thought it was the perfect one to add. I really like this look. I feel like I would wear this. I think it'd be cool for like an outdoor concert or just something where you might be outdoors, but you just want to be comfortable, but still look put together. This next trend is 80s baby. And I think I really nailed it with what I chose, but it's a super old tatty cashmere turtleneck that's thrifted, a pair of jeans from ASOS, a pair of Nike sneakers that I got in a consignment store, my thrifted bag, and a thrifted sparkly super 80s sweater. I feel like I had to pair it with the dad sneakers because it's not 80s without the dad sneakers. And I think also pairing the sweatshirt with a turtleneck underneath is really 80s. Also the shape, um, to make it more wearable because I'm not sure how much I might wear that out, I just added my trench coat over it because it kind of tones down the sparkles, but you still get the 80s vibe with the sneakers and the chunky knit. This next trend is called modern femininity and as you can see from the photo that I put up there it's just you know very flowy very feminine thing so here's my interpretation. I have a vintage La Perla cami that I paired with a vintage silk K&Y maxi skirt and a thrifted uh, little turtleneck, a thrifted bag and a pair of boots from Sam Edelman. I love the cream color of this and I just like that the like detail of this shirt gets to shine because it's scalloped at the bottom and it has just really pretty beading and metallic threading so i think that's definitely modern femininity the third trend is i'm sorry the fourth trend is back to black which of course black is all basic and boring i don't know how black is a trend but apparently so according to harper's bazaar but um in order to make it more interesting i think if you're gonna wear all black uh, you can liven it up by pairing with different textures. So I have this kind of satiny skirt, a cashmere fuzzy sweater, the leather boots, and then I add my sequin bag to add another different texture. And I think that makes this all black outfit interesting. You guys saw me deciding on which shoes to wear, but of course I went with my Ralph Lauren boots, but I think the Mary Janes are also really cute, especially if you wore like pattern tights so they poked through 
um and the next one this is an example of an outfit that i don't really think worked but and i never really include those in the videos but i feel like just so you guys can see my process you can see sometimes like what i have in my head just doesn't really come to fruition at first i paired it with the loafers but i felt like it just didn't go with the bomber jacket which by the way bomber is a trend i also broke my nail so i changed it to the sneakers which i think helped but this one's not my favorite let me know what you guys think or how you might restyle it to make it a little bit better with my denim bomber jacket the next trend is the white tank, which again is kind of interesting that it's a trend because I feel like that's definitely just a classic piece, but I have this green faux leather skirt from Aritzia, a thrifted belt, thrifted white tank, thrifted sweater, and my Converse again. So of course that's playing off the preppy trend that's in. I decided to just tie my sweater around my shoulders for one way you could wear, and then I have this other way where I just kind of tucked it and you could see the tank peeking through, which I think adds some interest. Um, and I like the sneakers with this one. I think it came out really good and the navy of the belt matches the navy and the varsity strap on the sweater the next trend is the twisted trench um now I'm, all of my trench coats are pretty classic but the one that i chose this one here is vintage leather and has a fur collar so i feel like that's definitely a twisted take on a trench coat because it's not the like the regular material everything in this look is thrifted this next trend is uh, just the highlights, so like highlighter bright colors, which again, I don't have many of, but I do have this dress that I decided to pair this uh, thrifted helmet laying see-through turtleneck over with a belt, my Ralph Lauren boots, and a little vintage bag, and I think it really is impactful. I don't know why. I really like that one. Um, this next trend is tux season. I do not have a tuxedo. I'm not really into tuxes or like suiting too much. I don't know because I just like to be a little more girly than like a suit allows sometimes. Um, and I just haven't have found one. But again, everything here is thrifted. The blazer is scotch and soda, but it's thrifted. And I like the uh, pairing of the tuxedo style jacket with the shorts and the flats lastly we have horse girl so this is just like a super equestrian look i have this thrifted linen uh little vest with the buttons which i think is really fun a turtleneck that i also got from asos american apparel like skinny pants which kind of look like jodhpurs so i think that added to it and amazon boots and a thrifted bag all right you guys thank you so so much for watching i really hope that you enjoyed please let me know which outfit was your favorite and which trend do you think you have in your closet or that you might want to try um and don't forget to like comment and subscribe if you liked what you saw have something to say or just like to keep up with the rest of the videos that i'll be posting here and again i want to thank you so so much for 1000 subscribers and i'll see you guys in the next one bye thank you. Mm.